This video response is going to go out to Roger Hodson, and if I mispronounce your name, I apologize in advance. And that's because you were once a member of the band Supertramp. I think you were one of the lead singers or whatever. I, I don't remember exactly all the things you were in the band. Uh, I do remember the band very, very well, and I'm very fond of Supertramp. And the reason I'm making this video response is because you uploaded a music video entitled Take the Long Way Home. I have heard this song so many times. I've actually watched the video whole nine yards. And I decided to ask you a few questions about your song. And according to the lyrics, now we're just, or I'm, I'm, I'm more like, it's not really so much I'm asking you per se, but uh, I, I'm sure you knew about the guy that you were talking about in the actual song. So these questions would be more to the guy that you're talking about in the song rather than you. But anyway, we'll just, we'll just see what kind of answers you come up with. According to the lyrics, okay, according to the lyrics, why do you think you're a Romeo? What did you do to become the joke of the neighborhood? What part of the scenery do you think you're becoming? And why, is your, why isn't your wife as nice as she used to be? How large is the city that you're constantly going to? What gallery are you playing in? Okay, uh, is it like a nightclub or something else? I'd, I'd like to know. And why are you performing on stage? Are you some kind of a musician? Are you a magic act? Are you a comedian? What? Okay. And why does your wife think you're losing your sanity? Okay. And when you reflect on your life, what do you think would your... Okay. When you reflect on your life, what do you think you would have become? Do you think you, we would have become a football star or uh, possibly a famous painter or, or what? I mean, what do you think you would have become if you had chosen a different life path? That's what I'm asking. All right. Now, what did I actually think of the song? It's really a nice song. It is well performed. Uh, I liked all the extra instruments in the song. It's not dry. It's not mundane. It actually it, it actually actually has a crescendo at the beginning of the song, which really makes it intense. Uh, now, if this was a song about modern times, I would say grab a hold of Harry Lorraine's memory book and change your life. But being that it was back in those days. I would say I kind of feel sorry for the guy in the song. But anyway, it's a well-performed song. It's a great song. It's a legendary song. And I loved it. And I still love it to this very day. I have it a part of my music collection. So, uh, great job. Good work. Uh, I don't know if you, Roger Hodson, uh, actually wrote it yourself or whatever. I, I uh, You can answer that if you'd like. So... Feel free to leave the answers to any of all the questions that I left in this video right down here in the comments below. And if you happen not to be Roger Hodson and you're watching this video right now, feel free to go over to his YouTube channel, watch his videos, rate his videos, um, comment on his videos, subscribe to his channel if you'd like, and more importantly, tell him that the speed learners say you. Alright, I will tell you more in a future video, so I'd like for you to stay tuned.